Hey guys, Aussie Steve here from Home by Louisiana. Um, here at this property we're checking out in uh, Slidell. Um, wanted to talk you through it. You know, we buy properties in any condition and situation, and uh, this one, this one's interesting um, in that the owner originally came to us, you know, probably about five months ago actually, and wanted to sell the house. Um, you know, we gave him a cash offer, and uh, the cash offer wasn't enough for him. So, you know, he ended up listening with a realtor, and you know, it's been missed on the market for about four months now. And he came back to me because uh, he wasn't really getting any offers or anything. So, you know, he wanted to see if I could still buy it. So I got to talking a little bit more and I found out the issue why he couldn't accept my cash offer was that he just owed uh, more money on the property in terms of his uh, mortgage. Uh, and the problem he's having in selling it is that the mortgage is actually really more than the house is worth. Um, so no one really wants to sell a property and have to go to a closing and pay someone to take the money, right? If you're upside down in your mortgage. Um, but there's definitely options. So when we know that, you know, there are ways that we can actually pay more than market price for a property um, if there's financing in place. Um, so that's what we're looking to do here. You know, we've had a chat with the owner and he's comfortable with it. So these are sort of deals where we actually take over the payments. Um, because for us, if we don't have to put all our own money in it, we can actually afford to pay more. Um, so, you know, so much if when we're paying cash and using our money, we need to get a return on that. We need, you know, need to think about what we put into the property. But uh, we can pay more if we don't need to put the funds in ourselves. We just start making the payments um, on the loan, and that allows us to pay more money um, than we normally would. And often we can pay above market, uh, above market rates. Um, so that's what we're looking to do um, in this case. And look, you might be thinking, well, how are you taking over the payments? What if you don't end up making those payments? And I mean, that obviously could happen, um, but there's a whole bunch of uh, fail sales in place. So if we were to ever not make the mortgage payment, within 30 days, he would get the property back. Now, obviously, he wants to sell his property. He doesn't want it back. And I can guarantee you, we don't want to give it back to him um, because he's actually behind on his payments. So when we buy the property, we bring him up to date. So we pay the arrears on his mortgage and then we start making the payments. So And, and we fix up the house. There's a few things to fix in here. Um, so uh, if we start making the payments, let's say in two years, we stop making payments. Within 30 days, you get the house back. Now, for us, we'd be out of pocket because we paid to bring him up to date. We paid for the rehab of the property and we spent two years paying down his mortgage. So he would be in a much better position um, still, um, but not that he wants that. And look, we're in the business of buying houses, not giving houses back. So um, that's not something that we'll do. Uh, but look, you can come in and um, check out the property. Um, look, there's no electricity and there's a uh, smoke alarm going. Um, so. It's a nice little house. Um, probably some of the things we need to check out and just run our numbers on. Uh, there's termite damage you'll probably see. Um, and you know, here, and if you, if you see tapping the walls, that's pretty pretty soft. It's even like just a bit indented by pressing it. Um, there's also some yeah, termites in here. So there's a bit of termite damage and um, you know, we need to figure out how extensive that, extensive that is. We don't mind buying houses with termite damage at all. We do it all day. Um, the numbers do need to work out and obviously in this case we are paying more than the house is worth so uh so we can't afford to spend too much on the rehab this is all a really moist here i'm wishing if you see this is water so some leaks so that's you know so look we still need to run our numbers on this property to make sure it works and we can pay above market rate for it uh, but we'll do that um, and uh, hopefully we can save this person from losing the house. You know, they are behind on their, on their mortgage, they're upside down, they're really ready to go, they live out of state and this, this house is just really a weight around the, around the neck. So um, hopefully we can uh, make this deal work for them um, and we do this sort of stuff all the time. So look, we buy houses that are run down and need a lot of repairs, but we also buy houses that maybe they're okay, but they're, for whatever reason, their value's dropped and that, you know, you owe more on it than it's worth. And we can often pay them, you know, if we use the existing, um, the existing mortgage in place. So look, reach out to Home Buyer Louisiana if you have a property to sell. Uh, we're happy to talk through how we may help you. Uh, we speak to a lot more people than houses we buy. So there's no pressure if you call us. We you know, uh, you know, put no pressure on you to sell your property to us. We'll just talk, we'll give you advice. We wanna help you. And look, if the best option is for us to buy it, fantastic, let's do a deal. If it's not, we still wanna help you and hopefully give you some advice. You can go out and, and make the best decision for your property. So look, go to homebuyerlouisiana.com and check us out. You know, if you're watching this on Facebook or YouTube, there's probably a button you can press to visit the site. Um, so look, guys, have an awesome day um, and I hope, I hope uh, we can speak sometime. Thank you.